Hello, welcome to LinkedIn in three minutes with me, Jamie Wilkinson. Today, look, this is something that you will have seen when you've been looking at profiles of people on LinkedIn, and it always mystifies me that people don't do more about it. But we're talking about the banner image or the header image which sits across the top of your profile page. And really, this is absolutely prime digital real estate. It's what we used to call in uh, print journalism, the above the fold stuff. It's the thing that's on the screen when somebody clicks on your profile. And it's a great opportunity to demonstrate your intent or some sort of element of your character or personality or your professional brand. Because it's amazing how many people have a LinkedIn banner photo that looks like this. That does not fill me with confidence for that person. It's very little effort to add a banner image, and uh, it's also very little effort to add one that actually means something for you know, who you want to be seen as on the platform. So there's a bunch of uh, options that you can do when it comes to this image, and these are some of the ones that I would favour. First of all, a really basic one, where you work is something that you can put on the um, banner image here, and that kind of shows people where your area of expertise or your professional areas of expertise actually lie. So that's something you could certainly think about if you were um, struggling for something. What about tools of the trade? If you're a specialist in a particular area, or you are um, an artisan, or you're well-known in a particular space, uh, you could use images of those tools that you use to get the outcomes that you look for. Some sort of reference to your target client's outcome or desires is also something that can be quite a powerful visual message for potential contacts on LinkedIn, as can a visual demonstration of your mission, what you're aiming for through your professional life. Um, this is one here. I'm, I'm not necessarily saying we all need to be uh, creating wind farms or wind turbines, but if your business is about uh, renewable energy or making the world a better place, for example, that might be something you could consider. You could have an image of where you work, either the building itself or the city, and that's quite useful, especially if what you do is relevant sort of geographically to finding new clients and new contacts. Or at worst, just some sort of pattern that demonstrates that you're slightly engaged with the platform and is a bit nicer to look at than that anonymous blue banner, which uh, is the default. So that's it for today. It's really straightforward. I recommend if you don't currently have a good banner image to go and get one. There are loads of free resources that are now available online to do that. And I'll see you next time.